What's up, Leaf Flex Bugs here. Let's do some wolf spidering tonight. Things you are going to want are a headlamp, and I have a couple settings on it. It's a pretty fancy one. Got it from Walmart for like 40 bucks. It's got some little focus lens on it. It's got two different light settings, like a high beam and a close beam, kind of. And you got uh, these guys here, some little containers to store specimens that I want to hold on to for later pictures. And then if I just want to get some pictures of it right then, and I want to get pictures of the ventral, and you're too afraid to like pick it up, pick it up, and hold it and turn it around. And also you want to get better views of the legs using this to put the little spider in to flip it over so you can see that ventral in the legs. Really, really helpful. With that being said, let's get started on the little spider journey and see what we can find. See some right over here. I walk up to the eyeballs, take a glance in the grass, and it looks like we got ourselves Rabidosa Rabida. There's our first bull spider of the night, and that is how I do it. And um, let's just keep going and see what else I can find. All right, we got ourselves a really exciting one right here. So this is kind of like the last, as you can see. This is Rabidosa punctulata. And what makes this spider have this name is this ventral. Always has some kind of black spotting. It's never consistent. And that is why it has that name. And these guys are very, very easy to handle and work with. This is why you can see I'm not too afraid of her. But just set her down right here. Let her do her thing. Let's keep going. One of the next species we got it's one of these little Shizakosa species. Small little guy, and they don't get much bigger than that. Let's keep going. Here's another beautiful punctuated specimen right here. She was just sitting there climbing the grass, just like these guys like to do. So like I said, if you're looking for Rabidosa, check out little grasses. They blend in quite well. Here we got a baby Hognan Teculenta. She will be a big girl when she gets older. Awesome cute little buddy got one of our first larger wolf spiders of the night this is gladicosa gulosa pretty rare species for people to, in texas to encounter and document um i've gotten a couple pictures and so he's gone he's over there he's running around this little corner and there he is beautiful coloration they have bright colored ventrals which separates them from pulchera which has darker body overall and darker ventral and are also arboreal and typically found on trees, while these ones are found on these little dirt rock faces and often live in burrows. There is the female to that male we've been looking for. This is Gladicosa chelosa female. The ventral is, the ventral is light colored. There she is, super, super cool. If you guys want full length videos like this on the YouTube, definitely let me know and I will keep on doing those for you guys. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys in the next one.